Hey guys, in this video I'll show you how I have this TV which is TCL C735 adjusted in order to get UHD, HDR, VRR picture from game console or PC. Specifically, now I have TV connected to PS5 using original cable that came with the console, but this applies to other ultra high speed HDMI cables that you can buy on the market. So first, if I press OK button on TV's remote, you see in top right corner, Game Master, FreeSync, HDMI 1 port, UHD resolution and frame rate 75 frames, 76, which means VRR is enabled. Now if I press PlayStation button and go to settings, First, let's see how I have screen and video adjusted. Uh, resolution automatic, VRR automatic, 120 Hz output automatic, ALLM automatic, HDR on when supported, and everything else is on automatic. In video output information, here you see resolution of current signal, 2160p VRR from 48 to 120 Hertz, HDCP is active and below you see basically everything is supported. So now let me go back to the game. Now let's see how I have TV adjusted. Uh, let's go through standard menus which is pressing settings button on the remote. This button with gear icon, going to settings and first menu that you need to open is this channels and inputs, then go to inputs and here make sure HDMI advanced standard is on, auto low latency mode enable if you want TV to automatically switch to game picture mode for lowest input lag and VRR is enabled with this control. In addition to this, there is Game Master menu, which you access if you go to System and open Game Master here. Here you see a description of which benefits it offers and when you enable it, you can toggle FBS display to show current frames per second and we see again same controls like in inputs menu, ALLM and VRR. So let's enable FPS display that you see how it looks. So it shows current number of frames per second. Next we have another menu with gaming options and you access it in two ways. You can press this quick settings and click on game bar or you long press this overlay button and it will appear. Here you have AGIG option for HDR signal, stats bar which will show current time and again number of frames per second and this last icon is related to this boost function which is basically VRR. If VRR is enabled, then this option will be set to fast. You also have balance and echo, but for VRR it needs to be set on fast. And that's basically it. It's important to use ultra high speed HDMI cable and use correct port on the TV itself because only ports number one and number two support up to 120 or 144 Hertz refresh rate. And guys, that's all I wanted to share in this video. Let me know in the comment section, is this procedure working for you? Which HDMI cable are you using and so on? And I'll support you, don't worry. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more videos like this and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye!